year we had Disney annual passes and we had a really good time and they expired while the quarantine was going on and we didn't know what to do because we were going crazy in the house and so we decided that we were gonna get universal annual passes this year because they were open and it was something new so we did did you have fun at Universal? Yeah! <laughs> yeah, we had a good time. last weekend and there were no lines. anybody there. Yeah. It was hot but it's Florida in the summer. It's gonna be hot. Right and we went to to Dr. Seuss land yeah. and Millie got to go on a couple of the rides and she really liked it. She was just tall enough to go on the 36 inch rides which was like maybe a smidge too short but we ruffled up her hair a little bit and she made it. <laughs> to Harry Potter land and we got a butter beer and uh, I bought a butter beer mug for $14 for some reason <laughs> but we get cheap refills of butter beer and we're gonna get one every time we go because butter beer is delicious Look at mommy's drinking it. yeah let's see that butter beer you want to try it let's try this That's good, right? Mom, try it. See? <laughs> Castle right there. Get some of this butter beer action. <laughs> hmm. You really want some butter beer? <laughs> Thank you, 
Hello. Hello. Here at the Gringos Money Exchange, we pay exchange common currency for an official Gringos Bank. Redeemable at many establishments in the visiting world. Look at her closing her eyes. She's scared of that guy. <laughs> Oh, he's a little scary. <laughs> he's not mean. No. Really, let me see. Very fine. Really. You've made it. He's scary. Like <laughs> as well as video recordings, if you must. In fact, a brief photograph is preferable to a persistent stare. Jimmy Fallon ride, which was fun. Um, I had to go by myself because Millie was too short. John bought me a Jimmy Fallon Turvis Tumblr, which I use all of the time, which I really like. We tried to do the child swap, but they just left me. They just sent me back out on the street. Yeah. Now we're waiting for mommy, right? Yeah. Oh, the Jimmy Fallon, on the Jimmy Fallon ride. What do you say, Mill? What do you say? No day, no. Okay. Bye, day, bye. Are you leaving? Yeah. Where are you going? You gonna go find mom? Yeah. Stay with me. Yeah. Stay with me. Yeah. Come back. Still waiting for mommy. And we got to take advantage of the child swap, which is a really cool policy that they have at the theme park when if you have a kid who's too small, you can all wait in line together and then one parent goes on the ride uh, and one parent holds the child and then when the first parent is done, you switch the child off and the second parent can go on. And that was nice. And a lot of rides, they actually have a special child swap room where you can go and wait and there's like a movie playing and you can look out the window and see the person, see your partner come back mm -hmm. on the ride. It's kind of exciting. We had to wear masks, but um, the weekend that we went, it didn't seem like it was too hot. And there was a lot of places um, that were designated areas that you didn't have to wear your mask, which was pretty cool. And you also didn't have to wear a mask, obviously, if you were drinking or eating. So it didn't seem to be too hot when we were there that weekend, which was kind of nice. It wasn't as burdensome as I thought it was going to be, wearing a mask. Yeah, you kind of get used to it after a while. I went the bandana route. I just tied a bandana and rolled it up. And uh, kind of let it hang in front of your face a little bit so it's not right on your mouth like a mask. It wasn't too bad. Mm -hmm. And... Um, we spent some time at City Walk, which was cool, because when we went to Disney, we spent most of our time at Disney Springs, which used to be downtown Disney, which is cool, but City Walk is, has just a little bit of a different vibe, and it was nice to have a change of pace. There's some really cool stuff at City Walk, cool restaurants. We got, we went to the Voodoo Donut Shop and got three donuts that were really good. <laughs> Let's see what's in there. Ooh, Millie, I see yours. Oh. <laughs> Are you a happy girl? You wanna have this as like a napkin? Try not to drop it, okay? What else we got happening in there? Oh, my God. This one? 
Yeah, it's a little boring, but okay. <laughs> Where's my ODB? Oh. That's pretty good. <laughs> place that we had dinner too that we had nachos the NBC. oh yeah the we went to the nbc uh it's like a sports restaurant it was mm -hmm. a little bit outrageously priced it was like eight dollars and fifty cents for a land shark which is a little bit hard to swallow but when you're in the heat and you really want a beer you'll pay it and the nachos were kind of meh they were just nachos with like a can of chili poured on top of them what are you doing cool kids cup though that I saved that mm -hmm. was really cool it has like the minions on it and all of the different like universal characters which was really, really loves the minions and she got to meet them that was really she fun. got to meet Krusty the clown mm -hmm. and Homer and Bart mm -hmm. and the Grinch and some other characters which we never heard of but which she was excited mm -hmm. to see <laughs> we stayed at the Hilton Doubletree, which was uh, right across the street from Universal, which was really cool because the first time when you get your annual pass, you have to pay for parking the first time because you have to go there and get the pass. So we were able to walk from our hotel to Universal, which was pretty sweet. It wasn't a very long walk. Um, so that was nice. The hotel was really nice. They had like a nice pool and a cool splash pad for Millie. We weren't able to go because um, it stormed at night and they closed it down. Um, but it was a really nice clean hotel it was. and I and really cheap. liked it. I think it was like $89 a night, which is pretty cheap for a hotel in Orlando. Yeah, I think we would go again for sure. I would sure. definitely go again. Yeah, so that was pretty sweet. And everybody in Orlando was really nice to me. Like it was Father's Day weekend and everybody who saw me with Millie kept saying, Happy Father's Day, and I was like, wow, that's really sweet. Yeah, everyone was really nice there. Mm -hmm. okay. Our hotel. Okay, bye. The Double bye. Tree by Hilton. Bye. And Saturday night, we went out to dinner at Bahama Breeze, which is one of our favorite restaurants mm. of all time we had a bunch of gift cards for there which was really nice and um we got some really cool food which and we fun. got ultimate margaritas mm -hmm. which is a margarita with patron with grand marnier in a frozen shot glass so that as you're drinking it the shot mm -hmm. glass melts and the grand marnier mixes into the drink it was fabulous yeah it was really really good and i got a skirt steak with chimichurri Mm, I forgot what I got. Oh, I got like a shrimp pasta. Oh, like a yeah. Spicy shrimp pasta. It was really good. I never had it there before. It was really, really good. Mm. And then on the last day, we went to the park for a little bit in the mm -hmm. morning, and then we got on the road and headed back, and we stopped in St. Armand's mm -hmm. in Sarasota to have lunch with my dad for mm -hmm. Father's Day. Uh, we ate at the Columbia Restaurant, mm -hmm. which is the oldest restaurant in Tampa, but they have a few of them now. Uh, it's a Spanish restaurant. It's fantastic. Mm -hmm. um, and so that was really nice, and Grandma and Grandpa got to spend some time with Millie and walk around and hold hands. and look in the shops and so it was a really nice Father's Day evening. Yeah, it was really good. Tasty food. Tasty. Tasty. <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, I'm gonna look at the menu over here. <laughs> I'll come here and say, fast! <laughs> Careful up there. Oh, it's got a ship on it, huh? Very pretty. Look at this. Happy Father's Day, you guys. Say happy Father's Day. <laughs> <laughs> so thanks for watching our vlog um we hope you enjoyed it and we'll be back with more mm -hmm. bye bye